to meet the needs of Europe's farmers into the 80s, Massey Ferguson proudly present a completely new range of tractors, the 2000 series. In fact, so completely new are they, it's probably fair to say that, once again, Massey Ferguson invent the tractor. First, it's a complete range of tractors, cab or platform, in two and four wheel drive versions, providing from 100 plus through to well over 200 horsepower. Completely new in design, they incorporate many new features to improve field performance. So output and productivity are higher than ever before. Reliability has been designed in and exhaustively checked out. 2000 series tractors will perform day in, day out, giving consistently high output. Routine maintenance has been minimized to avoid unnecessary downtime. This principle of avoiding wasteful non-productive time has been carried forward into the area of major service. Previously complicated jobs have been made much easier. For example, on 2000 series tractors, units like hydraulic are all equal. For the operator, a superbly comfortable cab. Ergonomically designed for ease of operation, it's quiet, air-conditioned whilst providing all-round vision that's better than any luxury limousine. To meet the needs of every farmer, whatever the job he wants done, 2000 series tractors come in a wide range of variable specifications and with a wide range of accessories. And finally, we've given 2000 series tractors the unmistakably classy look and lines of a thoroughbred to go with its breeding. Now see how all the other qualities of the 2000 series are brought brilliantly together for the first time. And the first tractor to become available in the range is the MF2640. Believe it or not, this is the smallest in the range, even though its refined Perkins six-cylinder engine supplies 104 DIN horsepower. This well-proven power unit has been modified in a number of significant areas to produce more power more reliably with greater economy and less noise and smoke. Special attention has been paid to eliminate even the smallest oil leak. The main transmission clutch is a cerimetallic single dry disc type fitted to the engine flywheel. When you see one of these, you know right away that it's different. Along with other MF tractors, it stands out from the crowd. It's not just the distinctive appearance that catches the eye. There's something about the way this big 2000 series attacks the work and handles the implement that makes it different. With 147 horsepower up front, a 16-speed gearbox and a rear linkage hydraulic system that senses draft forces through the lower links, there's no shortage of the right ingredients for an outstanding performance. Such a performance the 2000 series certainly have. There are many reasons why this is so, yet none are more important than the fact that the engine, the transmission and hydraulic systems are all perfectly matched to each other to achieve an unsurpassed level of overall efficiency. It's just this sort of difference that has enabled the 2000 series to earn the ultimate distinction of being considered real driver's tractors. For a start, the engines are the sort drivers like. They will often pull a higher gear at a lower engine speed than others. They make gear changing less frequent, so the tractor is that much easier and less tiring to drive. Drivers also like the way the gearbox allows you to change between gears whilst maintaining the same travel speed. It can cut fuel consumption quite a bit over a long day's work. And it's nice to know you've always got the extra traction and stability that comes from four-wheel drive. A good driver always keeps a watchful eye on the implement and makes adjustments whenever required. He knows that a wrongly set implement not only does a bad job, but can spoil the performance of even the best of tractors. <laughs> 